Hello everybody, this is Anaris, and I'm making this announcement video to go over a couple things. Number one, it looks like I've hit the 10,000 subscriber mark. Very exciting! No, actually, I was really uh, I was really excited when I saw that, so I just wanted to thank you guys and uh, the uh, one or two girls in the audience for subscribing. I definitely appreciate it. Glad you find my stuff useful, and I hope to continue making awesome stuff for you. So... Uh, other crap I want to go over here. Oh, um, this is this is definitely awesome. I did an interview with the Polygon Review. Uh, it is a gentleman over in Sweden. He does uh, interviews with all the top StarCraft players, commentators, um, map makers, stuff like that. So I did an interview with him, and if you look in the comment box below, you will see the link to his channel. Definitely go and check him out. Watch the video. Subscribe if you like it. And uh, I guarantee, I mean, he does amazing interviews. You'll love it. I guarantee it. So go check him out. Um, also, the map Nautakami that I made a little while back. I did some changes to the middle, and I need some people to play and test it, specifically with Terran. Um, I realize that uh, there are some choke points in the map, and really, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna fall into that that whole debate about you know if a map has a choke point it's OP for Terran. Um, but I need to see if it has the right balance. So if you guys can go online, check out Natakami. It should be listed in the, in the 1v1 or 2v2 listing. And if it's not, you can always create a game yourself. Um, just do a search for Natakami. And uh, that'll be in the comment box below with the appropriate spelling. Uh, what else? What else? What else? I've got a couple Zerg versus Protoss games that I'm going to cast over the next couple days. I've had a lot of people ask for those, and um, most of these are going to be coming from Korean level or Korean players, so definitely going to see some uh, good times with that. And I actually uh, I wanted to know what you guys thought about the challenge missions. I know the game's been out for a while, and I kind of let my uh, challenge missions fall to the wayside. Do you all want me to do some uh, commentaries on the rest of the challenge missions? Like, have you all been able to beat them? I realize there's other challenge um challenge guys up on YouTube right now, but uh, I'm not quite sure if some of them are up to par maybe with what you're wanting to do. I'd, I've seen a couple where, you know, they kind of barely scrape across the finish line. Uh, myself included, I because uh, when I did my first set, I had actually been awake like for two and a half days or something playing StarCraft 2. It was right when it first came out. So anyways, let me know if you want to see some challenge mission uh, walkthroughs. And other than that, I think that's pretty much it. Like I said, I just wanted to make this video to thank you guys for getting me to the 10,000 subscriber mark. Very excited about that. And um, I'm actually going to go to bed now. I've been moving into a new office all day, so... Finally settled in. Very nice in here, very cozy, and now I'm very sleepy. So, I will uh, see you guys later. Oh yeah, one more thing. Um new background on my YouTube page. It's not 100% complete yet. I'm going to draw in a couple more little uh, characters and whatnot from Eddie. But I wanted to know if you guys liked it or if I should switch back to something a little bit more StarCraft 2 Star, Starcraft 2 um, slash grittier slash, you know, whatever. But uh, let me know what you think of the background because, uh, yeah, I'd like to get some feedback on that. Alright, thanks. Later, guys.